Good morning, uh, energy started out well. We're finishing up camp, so the energy level is down. Uh, mentally and physically, we're going to take a, the afternoon off. And, uh, hopefully, uh, these guys will be refreshed coming back tomorrow. Uh, but, but like the squad right now, uh, we need to pay attention to detail a little bit more and, and, and that day-to-day -day and some of those monotonous things that we do daily that are so, so important. Uh, they may not seem that way to those guys, but they show up in the game all too often. So I uh, need to focus on that better, but I, I'm really excited and confident about the squad. And you guys lost a lot of production from last season. How are you looking to rebound with those numbers? Yeah, that, that's where the excitement and the confidence from an athleticism standpoint, I like what I see. Uh, the question is, what will that look like in the game? Spring practice is one thing, fall camp is one thing, and then the game is another level as well. So. That's that's where I'm excited and confident, but I won't be able to tell you after we, you know, go out there and actually compete in the game. How helpful is it having C B back for another year? Oh, I mean, you know, the quarterback position uh, is always looked at and as one of the most important, if not the important. So having a guy back there that's been there and done that to help some of those guys that we need to step up is extremely important. What are some of your expectations for the season? Get better every day. Get better every day is the bottom line and, and it's really a minute by minute meeting by meeting, just a process. And if we do that, we'll have a chance to be successful. And game one, just a couple weeks away, what do y'all still need to work on before the game? Yeah, 13 days, the focus, consistent focus. Um, it's, it's, it's not gonna, it's not gonna happen as far as the simulation goes out here in practice uh, is what's gonna happen to that game. So we gotta be more consistent day in and down out, day in and day out, and also down in and down out to uh, uh, to get what we want on a game day because it's it's extremely difficult to win, win football games. <laughs> what is it like going yeah. to it? Uh, it's, it's definitely a leadership role that I have to play. And uh, I'm excited about it. I got a lot of young guys under under me who are looking for guidance and, you know, kind of trying to feel themselves out. So it's a lot of encouraging, but I'm up for the task. What did you learn from the seniors last year, like, came in here now off the team, about going into that leadership role? Uh, I learned that. You know, it really starts with your play on the field. I can talk to them all day about how to run this route, how to run their route, but if I'm not out here executing every day, coming out here with energy, then it just won't translate and they won't take my word. They'll take it for granted. Really. Uh, what's it like coming back with a quarterback like CB? It's fantastic because he's an excellent leader uh, on and off the field, so we know what we're going to get when we're out here. All we have to do is run routes. He's going to put the ball exactly where he needs. And what are your expectations for the team this season? Um, my expectations are for us to get better each and every game. You know, we don't look past game one. All we do is try to get better day by day by day. And at the end of the year, we'll expect good results. And what do you think you're looking forward to the next I'm looking forward to just playing with my brothers. I, mean, I get one more opportunity to play football, or play this game that I love. I've been playing since I was three years old. So getting a chance to come out here for another year is fantastic. So uh, what position do you play, Chase? Uh, no, sir. Uh, what's it been like for you playing here at Southeast? Uh, man, it's been a great experience. Uh, learned a lot from players, coaches, and everyone in the organization. Um, very family oriented. So I mean, man, it's a good feel. What year are you this year? Uh, I'm a senior. I actually just graduated like three days ago. What was that like? Oh man, it was a grind, but I got it done. How does it feel for you uh, coming to this football season, having graduated? Already? Uh. I definitely have to be more focused um, since I'm starting Masters and uh, just being a better leader and just get things done. What are you going to study for your Masters? Um, sports administration. So uh, how are you planning on taking some of these guys that are incoming freshmen and kind of putting them under your wing this season? Um, just holding them, just holding them uh, accountable, um, making sure they're doing the right things. But first, I have to lead by example. And then the transitions, it transitions on and off the field. What kind of improvements do you want to see in your game this season? Um, being more effective pass wrestling. And, uh, you know, just keep playing with fanatic effort. Coach Brace preaches all the time. You know, you know, uh, playing with fanatic effort is a down payment on the house. You got to pay your rent. And uh, what do you think it's going to take for this team to be successful this season? Um, we just got to take it one day at a time, one play at a time. We can't get too ahead of ourselves. We just got to play every down, every snap like it's our last, and just execute. 